This is Hi. Laura Vander. This is Laura Vander. I'm a mother of five. I'm a mother an of author, five. Journalist, an author, and speaker. journalist, and speaker. And this is Sarah Hart. And this is Sarah Hart. I'm a mother of three. I'm a mother of three. Practicing physician. Practicing and blogger physician. on the side. And blogger on the we side. We have two working parents. We have two who working love our parents who love our and careers. And our families. And our families. Welcome to Best of Both Welcome Worlds. Welcome to Best of Both Here Worlds. Here we talk about how real women manage work and time for fun. And time for fun. From figuring out child From figuring out child care. To mapping out long-term career goals. We want you to get the most out of life. To get the most out of life. Welcome to Best of Both Welcome Worlds. Welcome to Best of this Both Worlds. Laura. This, this is, is Laura. Episode this is 269. 269. Airing in late September, in late 2022. September of 2022. I am going to be interviewing, going to be teen, interviewing sleep teen sleep Lisa Lewis. expert Lisa Lewis. She is the Lewis. author, she is of, the author sleep of Sleep Deprived Teen. Sleep Deprived Teen. And has been instrumental, has been instrumental in, the in, in the California in California to start high school to start later. They now have a law in California that high schools cannot start before 8.30 a.m. And so that was partly her handiwork Based she wrote on the Los she Angeles wrote Times Los several, years, times, ago several years ago. Several years ago, advocacy for that. Advocacy for that. Partly as a parent, partly as a parent, deprived teen. Deprived teen. Was that seeing that there was, was a huge problem. There was a huge problem with this setup. With so, this we're setup. Forward, so we're looking forward to talking with her, her, talking with her about why it is so important is for teens to sleep. Why high school start times are generally not set up to make that possible. And we're looking forward to that. Looking forward to that. Yeah, Sarah, you don't have teens who sleep in yet. No, nor do no, I even have like, nor do I even have like queens who sleep in. I am waiting, I am for, waiting that, for that milestone when, milestone when like like I get to the point where I'm waiting for my kids to wake up. We're, we're definitely, up, definitely, we're, not, we're there definitely not there yet. Generally, my kids Generally, sleep better my kids on sleep Sunday better than they do on Sunday than they do on Saturday because I guess later Saturday I do a better job. I do a better job tiring them out. Perhaps Saturday morning, Saturday morning, not uncommon to have someone bounce out of bed at like six a.m. Which is also kind of funny because on school days, a lot of times I'm having to drag them out at six forty-five. So I don't know. I got some early risers. I got some early risers. I am an early riser. I am an early riser. Maybe there's a connection. Maybe there's a connection. I'm not sure. That's the worst. Yeah, yeah, when they're the bounding out, when they're bounding out of bed before their time, before their time, before their time weekdays, on, on weekdays, like, like on right. weekends, you're missing the point here. You're missing the point here. This is not how this is supposed to work. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe we're seeing some genetic differences here. You and me, because my twins definitely sleep in. I mean, Jasper and Sam are in full full teen mode. I mean, they would sleep. I mean, they would sleep ten, eleven in the morning. Eleven in the morning. If we left them, even on weekends, it's not so much that they have morning activities. Morning activities. If you need to wake up at six thirty or seven during the week and you sleep during the week and too late on the weekend too late on the weekend you can't, weekend, get, back you can't track. get back on track so you know i'm generally so, waking you know, I'm up generally waking them up 9, somewhere in there and somewhere in there we sometimes we sometimes are waking are even waking alex even henry up, up on weekdays up on which weekdays, is kind of which is nutty kind of nutty alex is usually up alex he doesn't usually up he doesn't have to wake up until about elementary school starts at nine which is nine which is just completely just completely backwards from little kids versus little kids versus big kids operate especially now that our elementary now that our only trade schools are only Make a lot of it would make a lot of sense switch it. to switch but, it. But you know, Henry, as you know, he's Henry, been, as dropping, he's been the regular dropping the regular now, is definitely sleeping, is definitely sleeping longer in longer. the morning. So in the morning, sometimes so you know, sometimes you know, seven thirty, closer to seven thirty, closer to weekends. So on weekends, there are times I'm definitely, up, times I'm definitely up, up before all of my kids, now, which, is my kids now, now, which is that, that had not happened, had not happened for a long time, long, long time. What do you do with that found? What do you do with that? I usually just lie in bed because I don't want to wake anyone up. I don't want to wake anyone up. If I start walking around the house, it's going to mess everything up. Mess everything up. The dog will start barking. Somebody will hear me. They'll be like, like, from I the just, you know, like I just lie you know, as still lie as, as possible. still as possible. But, you know, often but, at least one know, weekend often, morning, at least one weekend I morning, am I am out running, out usually running. So that's usually so that's getting me up and then getting me up and then going to a church. I going to a church. Usually needs to be up around seven forty-five to get ready for that. Anyway, for that anyway, so. for that anyway so. it's not like anyone's it's sleeping that anyone sleeping that long. That makes sense. That makes sense. Well, I have. I look forward to me. I look forward to me shifting a little bit as they get older because I don't think we've seen the full hormones can do and even my do and even my I was just thinking about this. Just thinking even though about I this, do get up early, now, get up early and by the way, now, I do that with an alarm. Way, like, it's not like an alarm. Like it's not like I'm bounding outside at like four forty-five. Like, like four forty-five. I'm so weak now. I'm so weak now. Like even I slept till. Like, even I slept till really late. Really on weekends, late. As on teen, weekends so. as a teen, so, so there's hope. There's hope. Yeah, there's hope. Yeah, well, sort of. Yeah. I guess. Well, sort of, I guess. <laughs> so you fixed your bedtime routine, so you fixed routine, your bedtime which is awesome. routine, which is awesome. Your kids in bed, your kids in bed on time. Did you want to talk about that? Did you want to talk about that? Or I think I've talked some I about it, but I got to say, like, but I got to say, like, for the sleep equation, right? There's one they wake up, and then there's how bedtime works, and I do feel like we do feel like great progress. Great progress. This is a huge pain point. Kind of end of the summer, going into the summer, going into the school year, and I just put a lot of energy, a lot of energy. 
energy like and kind of like firmness into it, which is not into it, which is not necessarily, it, necessarily my default parenting, parenting style. style. And it, it does off. seem really excited really about that. I can usually have that. I can usually have kids in their rooms at least in their rooms at least by eight thirty. A little bit of time, a little bit of time to myself, which is fantastic. It is nice. Yeah, it is nice. Yeah, to get so Henry's still a wild card in our bedtime in our bedtime because he doesn't always he doesn't always go to bed at the same time. I wish he did, but that'll get better. I'm that'll sure get better. Every time, but I'm sure every time. The four big we kids. We have a very we have a very strict, strict routine now. Routine on now. Weekday evening. Weekday evening. Which is that everyone which is that needs everyone to be needs in to be their rooms in with their no rooms devices with no devices by nine o'clock. By nine o'clock. Mommy is and still mommy putting Henry still to bed putting at that time, which does happen. Which does happen. Taking a longer time to go down. a longer time to go down. They still need to get their devices into my room. Into my room. By nine o'clock. By nine o'clock. They have been very good at it. They've been very good at it. They will all tromp over there. Put trump over there. Put devices. And, and then there. return to their and rooms. Return to their they rooms. can read. They do can whatever. Read, do whatever. In their rooms. In their rooms. I start circling I start around. Circling to around. Turn off to turn off lights. Nine forty-five. Nine forty-five. So between nine forty. So between nine forty and nine forty-five and ten is, is chat with all the kids. Chat with lights all the kids. Time. Lights out time. Yeah. Check on yeah. everything. Check on if everything. Somebody, if if somebody somebody supposed to shower and forgot to shower and forgot to shower that that is reminded that that is reminded. And then lights out for everyone is by everyone is by ten. And because of that, because of that, I'm not. I mean, I'm not naive enough to think that. Even falls, falls asleep, asleep immediately, by asleep 10, immediately by, by 10, 10. But I do. You know, if you don't have you know, your devices, you don't and, have the your devices out, and the light and is out, is being and that police, is being police, it's easier to fall asleep. It's easier and so to fall I'm asleep. Sure and so I'm pretty sure Jasper that is asleep Jasper by is asleep 10.30 most nights. Most nights which means that which if he means has that to get up at 6.30, he, has to get up he is getting the eight hours of sleep. hours of sleep is sort of the minimum that teens do need. Ideally, it's more. Ideally, it's more. Like ideally, at 9.50, he's falling asleep earlier, and then he's getting more than the eight hours. More than the eight hours. But you know that's but, the goal you know, there. Salmon the goal Ruth, there. If the lights are out at ten. They do generally go to bed. They generally go to bed around. They wake up at seven. They wake so up at nine seven, hours. So that's nine hours. Alex. Alex. Ten to. Ten to. You know, if he's up seven you know, thirty, he's up seven thirty. Nine and a half that's hours. nine and a half hours. And then. Henry. And then Henry sometimes naps, sometimes naps, but he's probably but getting he's probably more getting like 11, more like 11, 11 to 12 total 11 to 12 hours, total sleep so hours per day. So we are on it. We are that on it. Happening. That um, is happening. I am very um, strict, am about, very it again, strict about it again. Also in a way that I usually, not, way that I usually with, am not, you know, with children. Yeah, you know, you're, this children. is yeah, like, you're, not, this is like not at all with most things. So I'm impressed. And I'm impressed. And speaks to the fact that like, speakers like Lisa and others have made an impact in both of us. How important that sleep time is. That sleep time is. And how important it is to have a little bit of boundary at the end of your day. That's predictable as well. Your day that's predictable as well. Yeah, because then I get 10 to 11 to do whatever. Because my bedtime is 11. Because my bedtime is 11. If I need to be up at 6. 30, uh, seven and a half that's hours, seven and, and a half so that's, hours, and so you know, that gives me you know, some downtime as well. Some downtime really as well, which I really and appreciate, and not having to not having go to straight from go straight from kids sleep stuff if I have any sleep hope. Of, if I have any hope, of, getting enough sleep, <laughs> getting enough sleep. Yeah, no, there's there was yeah, a little no, grumbling about it. There's some grumbling about it. There's some grumbling about it. Occasionally, but they do it. But they they do it, and so. I, so we'll see. I, Hopefully, it we'll lasts. See. For Hopefully, the year. it lasts for the Michael year. Seems to have bought Michael into seems it as to well. have bought into it as well. And I know that when I've and been, I know that when I've been traveling, they've also they've also put their devices away. Their devices pretty away. Good. Alex pretty sometimes good. does, Alex sometimes reminded, does but, need to be reminded. You know, but as long as somebody's you know, focused on somebody's reminding him, then everyone reminding else is doing. Everyone else is doing. Awesome. Yeah. Awesome. Well, I'm yeah. excited to hear this. I'm excited to hear this. Yeah. Let's see. Yeah. Let's see. Let's hear from Lisa about why it is so important for kids to sleep. Well, I am delighted to welcome Lisa Lewis to the program. Lisa is Lisa is the author of the sleep deprived the new book that the new book that looks all the way is all the way teenagers, teenagers are not getting enough sleep, sleep these days, days and, and why that is a problem. So Lisa, I wonder if so you could Lisa, introduce, wonder yourself, wonder if you could introduce, to introduce yourself to our listeners. Yes, hi. Yes, Thanks yes, so much hi. for having Thanks me. Thanks so much for having As me. As you mentioned, my book just came out a couple just months ago called The Sleep Deprived Teen. Why our teenagers are so tired and how parents and schools can help them and help them And I'm so happy to be here to chat about teen sleep. Yeah, and so how did you get, you know, involved get, you know, in this involved issue in the beginning because you've been championing this issue, championing for, a championing this issue for a few years now. Yes, I have yes, been immersed, have in, been this immersed in this for the last seven, seven years. Seven years. It all started for me in August of 2015 because that was when that was when my son was entering high school, school entering high school, beginning of his freshman year. Of his freshman and year. at that point, and at that our point, local public high school started at seven thirty in the morning, and that felt incredibly early. It was the earliest. 
that he was had the ever had to, had to ever school. had to go to school. And it was and quickly it was obvious. Quickly I would go on drive side of school. We leave the house every day. Leave the house at 7, 10. It was quickly that obvious. It really just it was really too just early. Was he was too early. He was hardly early. He was hardly And I was hardly dropping off someone who was in, you know, in perfect shape to be going off for a full day of learning. So I started looking at you. I was trying to figure out why does our high school start so early? And what I and what I was that found out was this that was not unique this was to not our unique community to our community yes unfortunately yes, the case unfortunately, is so, case many, in high so many high schools around the country even today there are high schools that start not just at 7 not just at 7 a.m. and that's first period and that's first period mandatory attendance mandatory attendance mandatory not like optional, not like classes. optional classes so so one thing led to another. One I thing led to another. I started, I started writing, writing about it. Writing about it. At the time that I got the time the issue was solved, the issue was hitting a critical really mass because, because the previous because year, the previous year, 2014, 2014, the American Academy, the American Academy, Academy, Academy of Pediatrics just released its policy, just policy statement, statement recommending recommending, recommending, recommending high school start no earlier than eight thirty. So it was. So it was. Yeah, at that point, at that, that point, involved, that I was getting involved, about it, starting to write about it, an op-ed I wrote, an op-ed which I wrote, ran in the which Los ran Angeles Times, the following, times fall, the following fall, ended up being read ended up by, being one read by one of our state state senators, senators, state senators who had a high school, who had a high school, the issue, issue, resonated, with issue resonated with him. He ended up introducing the bill, bill on the topic, on the topic. I got swept up in that whole journey, which was two and a half years, two and a half years, lengthy, lengthy process, got signed into law in 2019, three-year implementation, three-year implementation. Just, that, went just went into effect this past, past summer. summer. This past so summer, it's been quite so a ride. It's been quite yes, a ride. Been, uh, yes, seven been, years. Uh, seven years. years that I've just been living and just been living and living and breathing the teen sleep, sleep issue. issue. So why on so earth, why do, on high earth do high schools start too early? Because I know historically this has been the case. I mean, has been the case. District if a district has a high school, a middle school, an elementary school, an elementary school, and a K through eight school, almost inevitably, almost inevitably, high school will start. The high school will start the earliest of the three. And why? is that like why, why is that, that? like why is that, that most places that have most had. places have had i know and it i know well and it, it's so well it comes down so to, it comes yeah, down to yeah, phrase, yeah, it's in a phrase, phrase it's no schedule, schedule the schedule because because what happens in many what districts is many districts, districts they have one fleet, they, they have one fleet and of so buses. for budget and reasons, so for budget they decided to do that, that and, and, and that schedule and, and they schedule a system 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 for drop offs for drop offs so then they don't have to they don't have to have running at the exact same time and when and they first put these schedules, put these schedules in place, these back budget these, pressures, these budget pressures really were hitting the really districts. Hitting the district. This was this was before the before research on the research on white was wiping out. Was and so at that and so at that point, the default often was, often was, was well, let's put the oldest kid, the oldest kid, because the oldest should be at the handlet. Well, of course now we know. Well, of that. course now we know. Because now we have all this research on teens. But those I call those legacy schedules because those schedules have endured. Long past the point where we know that anything should be the exact opposite. I mean, literally, some districts can make some districts can make so that they have so that they have. Starting the yeah, I mean, yeah. So let's I talk mean, a little so bit about what happens. With, I mean, we'll with, get to the. I mean, we'll get to the objection. To, just flipping it. To just flipping but, it. But let's talk about what let's goes talk on about what goes on with brain the teen and brain and, teen and, and sleep, sleep schedules. Sleep because, schedules. You know, because, somebody might look at you know, somebody might look at that and say, "Well, you know, they should just go to bed earlier. They should go to bed earlier. So, what's going on with teenage that makes it not that makes it not quite that straightforward? Yes, I did smiling because those smiling because those kind of things that often come up because you know when because you know when you don't realize some of the basic some of the basic things that are 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 so, so what has been shown has been and shown and now in decades of research decades now, of research now is that is at that puberty at our puberty kids are to a later sleep, sleep schedule. schedule. So they have a circadian, so have a circadian rhythm, rhythm shift. shift. And what that means and is what that, means that, that means the is timing, the time shift shift later for when they're feeling sleepy and also for when they're ready to wake up in the morning. And you sort of just see this in your house as you have a kid, as you have a kid older than when your kid is little, when your kid is little, they are bounding out of bed at six in the morning to go. Raring to go. Teens don't tend to do that. don't tend to do that. And that's because they're on the schedule. So your schedule. Melatonin, so, which is melatonin, the hormone that primes, the hormone that primes, primes sleepy, to feel sleepy, begins sleepy, to be begins to later in the evening, later in the compared evening, to compared younger to younger. Kids. Kids. And so what that means is, and so what that means is, the teens feeling, 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 fe
I yeah, say 11 o'clock yeah, at night, I say 11 o'clock at night, you know, so when early, you know, so start feeling like they're going to 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 start feeling like they're going to
what you want to do. Yes, that, that is something that's that going to happen. Not everyone is going to have a donut, but you have a donut, but you have a solution for that. Solution for that. However, however, does help? And this is part of having that implementation window. It's starting off with communicating about why this is being done. This is not just 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 being done. This is being done. This is not just 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 being done. This is 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 being done. So, and so I like to start I like to start just setting some of those setting some of those spaces to have to people understand, have really people understand really what's at stake. This is not that this is not just something just that's being something done that's being done change a logistical change in public, public health research it has, the backing, health research research has the backing every major medical every program, major medical program, not just the American Academy not just the American Association psychological psychological association to look at this as a look at this as a public health issue and make sure it's and make sure it's grounded and understanding so it doesn't get derailed. Doesn't get by derailed by logistics, by consideration, logistics considerations, which again I know that which doesn't again, I know that doesn't answer the perfect answer to that specific that example, specific but it example, does help. It does help put it in context. context because if you were talking about because if you were talking about say lead paint or asbestos, you know people wouldn't say you know people wouldn't say we know we should we know we should because we can't because of logistical issue. And so I you know and so I you know sometimes it's just making sure people understand why people understanding why this first thing that goes a long way towards helping towards helping maybe. Maybe have the conversations, have the conversations, be more open, you know, have, and you know, have more kind of open, more kind of open solutions that can solutions come about. That can come about. So, what have districts on so doing, doing that? Do have doing that? Do have three tiers of buses? Three tiers of buses. And especially if you don't want elementary school starting at school starting at seven thirty, seven thirty. Is there a best practice? Is there a best practice? Because that's probably what you know people get hung up on. People get hung up on. Well, and see, this is well, and see, this is there is no thing. There is no one best practice because there are so many different scenarios out there. I mean, in every single district, these schedules. Sort of have come sort about, have come about because of because you know, things of, that had nothing to do with student well-being. Like, well, you know, we, we need to you know, we need to cut our, our bus budget, and so we're going to do it with this tier system. And in system. many cases, those in many cases, haven't been, been updated, been updated, in, updated years. in years. I mean, just as an example, I mean, just as an example, I think underscores it at the time. At the time, my son was entering high school. 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 So elementary school, so elementary school, school somewhere all started at somewhere between five, seven, eight, ten, five, and eight, ten. Middle school started middle school at eight forty-five, which is perfect. Which is and perfect. high school started and at high school started at seven, which was this, huge, which was this dramatic huge, change. Dramatic and, you know, change. Right, and you know, right, and high school, and all the school, and all the school that much earlier. But here's the rub. But here's the rub. At that point in time, at that point in time, we're even offering bus service for high school because of budget, because of budget. And yet, and yet, start times and start times. So we couldn't even say like, oh well, at least it's being done. Because, because, because this valid reason. This valid so reason. I mean, that's just so a, I mean, that's just a egregious example. Of, egregious example of, you know that these schedules, you know, that these schedules have not been updated. Have not been updated so years. Been so many years. Often, often it is time. Often it is time to take another look at them. Look at there them. may be ways. There may be ways to streamline. Streamline you know, whatever schedule. You know, whatever has been schedule has been put in place. Because again, that can't. Because again, that can't. No one should really be starting at seven or seven seven or seven thirty. And so sort of so looking at it again with looking at it with fresh eyes. Often it's time. Yeah. See if yeah. you can get a few more buses. Although finding buses, 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 buses seems to be its own problem. <laughs> <laughs> right. Well, yeah, yeah, exactly. Well, yeah, and there exactly. are these extra boundaries. And, and, you know, and, and yes, yeah, true. true. And yes, true. You don't want you don't sleep, want to be the thing that suffers as a result. Suffers as a result. Something has to give. Something has to give in that equation. But when you look at the harm, when you look at the harm because of this, I think because of this, I think that has has been downplayed, unfortunately. Yeah, it's it's very strange. It's very curious what we're having in our district. In our district, is waiting a year to announce it. After announce it, after you know everything's been with COVID, been with COVID. The neighbors next to the neighbors next to the one of the high schools absolutely do not want lights. Do not want lights. Have taken the whole thing to court. Taken the whole thing to court. So we shall see. So we shall see how it all pays. But yeah, so we are still yeah, so we are still at seven thirty. So for those of us who are in a situation like this, situation like this where you know you know 7 30 7 30 high school starts school, high school starts sign how can how we can we boost the chances boost the of chances our kids of our getting kids adequate getting sleep adequate even knowing sleep, that even knowing that there is this reality of reality of, teens of wanting to teens wanting stay up to later and stay up later and in the sleep morning later in the what morning what can we do to what can kind we of, do to kind of you know help the situation you know, help even the if situation even if it's not ideal yeah 
Yeah, and I have some other and ideas too. Other ideas, ideas too. Going back, going back. We have time to get back. We have time to get back. Yeah. Oh, sure. Yeah. Oh, sure. Yeah. Because again, I get back. Again, I get back to really trying to understand the why this is being done. Chronic sleep deprivation. Chronic sleep deprivation. Our teens have. Our teens have suffering. Is suffering these last several years. Last several years. Every year, it's gone on. Everything is gone on. Et cetera. 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 And so, one pretty straightforward step. Just take a look at everything, everything that, that is currently, currently on your teen's plate. Add up the hours. Add up the hours. Each of those, you know, because particularly when you're taking on yourself a class, you're taking on yourself a class. Generally, expanded homework. Generally, expanded homework. See, add all that up. See, add all that up. Plus those hours that are dedicated to their sports or theater or you know, speech debate. Yeah, 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 speech debate. Yeah
and that can be an issue. Yeah, that but if you're talking, issue. Well, if you're talking, talking around, you're talking around, around, I mean, dinner time. I mean, it's sort of figuring out what is too late. It's the same way there are noise. The same way there are noise. Regulations and regulations and different things. So is it reasonable to have them? Is it reasonable to have them at 9 o'clock at night? That would seem to be preferable. I would say 10 o'clock at night. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't want kids out having kids at 8 o'clock. And I will also mention that you probably don't
Oh, that's yes. perfect. Oh, that's perfect. Yeah, particularly, yeah, particularly, yeah, particularly yeah, maybe a little younger, younger than, maybe a little younger than mine. Because having those having routines, set, those routines set. Yeah, when kids are yeah, younger, when kids are younger, it makes it easier at teens and at teens and at these demands, these demands, ramp up. It's a great practice. I will say, I will say, I will say, I am enjoying, enjoying, literally this week, literally this week, the break in the weather, break in the weather, California, California, beastly hot, beastly hot, for a good ten days. And that makes it hard. Makes it hard to so I am very so grateful. I'm very grateful. We're turning the corner. We're turning a little hint of getting a little hint of fall. And my crisp and cotton my sheets. Cotton <laughs> sheets. <laughs> those are good. Those, those, those make sleep excellent. Those make sleep yeah, excellent. Yeah, excellent. Yeah, excellent. Yeah, getting some good sleep. Getting some, some good nice blankets. Some nice that blankets that I'll be able to use. I don't like be able to use. I don't like those too cold. But a little bit of a little bit of nip in the air. Nip in the air. Yeah, it's a delightful thing. Delightful thing. Sleeping well. Sleeping well. Well, Lisa, this has been great. What did you tell our listeners where they can find you? Yes. My website, my is website Lisa is lisalewis.com. I do use my middle initial just my middle because it's just because it's a somewhat so common name. name. So my book is Lisa, Lisa L. Lewis, and, Lewis, and the book is and the book is to sleep deprived teen. Why are teenagers so tired? Why are teenagers so tired? And how parents and schools can help them thrive? Can help them thrive. Oh, and I should mention Twitter. I should mention Twitter and Instagram. At Lewis, Lisa L. Lisa L. Awesome. All right, Lisa. Thank you so much for joining us. Thank you so much for joining us. Thank you so much. Really enjoyed it. Thank you so much. Really enjoyed it. All right. So that was. Right. Great. So Hearing that was from Lisa great. Hearing about from Lisa teens about teens sleep and what we can do to make sure that our communities are supporting, healthy, supporting healthy sleep for teenagers. So Sarah, you wanted to, so Sarah, you wanted you know, to include you know, this in lieu of a question. We have a reader question. 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 Reader and had a strategy that had a strategy that was working, working in their household years. for many years. She meets with her kids. She meets with her kids year, twice before year, school starts. Once before school starts. Once when they go back in January. And that they meeting, decide what they decide what breakfast is going to be and put, going to be and put, it, on to be and put it on a schedule. Since there's buy-in from since the kids, they are from not resistant to the meals. Since it's predetermined, since it's predetermined, since it's predetermined, since it's predetermined, the decision-making conversation conversation every morning. They came up with maple Mondays, maple Mondays, maple syrup, pancakes with maple syrup, toast Tuesdays, toast Tuesdays, grits with toast or avocado toast, toast or avocado toast, waffle Wednesdays. Waffle Wednesdays, Thursday Thursdays, Thursday Thursdays, which is a smoothie. Don't get excited. Fun Fridays, which Fun is cereal. Fridays, which is cereal. And, and see, is there a weekend? See, is there a weekend? She, no well, specific she, weekend no rotation, specific but weekend that makes sense. Weekend rotation, but that makes sense. Weekends tend to be less hectic anyway. And she writes, they also always have fruit as a side, as a side, and keeps some other and keeps some other on hand. On hand, she likes having that second meeting in January. Meeting in January, the kids can shake things up to avoid burnout. I just thought that was so cool. I've always wanted to have. I've always wanted to have this rotation. This rotation. Maybe I haven't had. Maybe I haven't had. Enough kid input, maybe kid it was input, their maybe rotation, if it was there, there would be more excitement, would be more around, excitement said around, rotation. Said rotation. I will say, I will say, I have learned that the secret I have learned to giving my kids oatmeal and not hearing oatmeal and not hearing serving it with chocolate chips. Serving it with chocolate chips. So that is my pro tip. So that is my pro tip. I think anything with chocolate chips can reduce the whining. It's something about the chocolate chips. It's the tiniest little bit of chocolate. Whipped cream is another thing. Whipped cream is another thing. You can try anything. Almost 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 anything. To reduce the whining, to reduce the whining. Yeah, that was a great. Yeah, that was a great tip from our listener about having a morning rotation like that. My older children are responsible for their own breakfast. My older children are responsible for their own breakfast. And then Alex is happy to just have a freezer waffle and a piece of cheese. A piece of cheese. So you know. So you know. I think that's another 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 so this has been best so this of both been worlds. I've been talking worlds. with I've Lisa Lewis, Lewis, Lisa who, Lewis uh, is an who uh, on is an expert on sleep, teen. Uh, was helpful in uh, getting helpful in California to pass California legislation, to pass legislation, making sure that, that high schools start later, later, to, start take later to take into account teen sleep needs. Sleep needs. We, will we will be back next week. We will be back next week with, with more, more on making work more on making work and life fit together. Thanks for listening. Thanks for you listening. Can find me, Sarah, you can find me at the shoebox. At the shoebox. Or at the underscore shoebox, 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 shoebox on Instagram. And you can find me. And you can find Laura, me at Laura Vandercam. At Laura Vandercam. Com. Com. This has been the best. This has been the best of podcasts. both worlds. Podcast. Please join us next. Time Please join us next. For more time. on making work. For more on making work, work, work together. Work together.